Hi all, welcome to Simple Engineering, Engineering Simplified. I am Dr. Neeti PS. Today we are going to discuss about uh, play fair zipper technique, which is a substitution technique in cryptography. So let's move to the video. So our question is encrypt the message. The message is given as my name is Christ. And the keyword is given as security. So by using this Playfair cipher technique, we have to encrypt our plain text into a cipher text. So key is also given. So the first step in this Playfair cipher is the plain text which is given as my name is Christ. This Christ, this which uh, we have to divide uh, or separate into uh, two letter grouping so my name is christ i can write it as m y my this is one group n a is one group m e is one group i s is one group c h r i and s t so if for example your uh, plain text is my name is chris so t is not there so which means that the last grouping it will have only one letter which is S. So we have to add X for the element over here. Then the next step is we have to make a phi cross phi matrix and we have to implement your key keyword in that phi cross phi matrix. So first we can make a phi cross phi matrix 3, 4, 5. So it will be having 5 rows and 5 columns. So the keyword is given as security. So we will write it as S, E, C, U, R, I, T, Y. Then we have to check the all the alphabets. So the Playfair cipher, the rule is that uh, we will write A, B, C, D, all these elements up to Z in this phi cross phi matrix. So we have phi cross phi means only 25. But we have from A to Z, 26 elements are there. So for the letter I, we have I bar J. So both it will be uh, written in a single cell. As your keyword consists of I, we are just writing it as I. So this is done. Next we have to check with A. So A is not there in the keyword. So you can fill one cell with A. Next is B. B is also not there. Then C, it is already there in your keyword. So you have to skip that. Then D is not there. So you have to write D. Then E is also there in your keyword so you have to skip e so next comes f g h i is already there so it will be i slash j so i j is over next is k l m n o p q R is already there in your keyword. So you cannot write R here. So P, Q, R, S is also there. T is also there. U is also there. So next is V, W, X. Y is already there in the keyword. So next is Z. So this is the way which you have to fill the 5 cross 5 matrix. So you have to omit the uh, elements in the keyword. So S C C U R I T Y security is our keyword. So that first we have filled. After that we have filled the remaining cells with the uh, alphabets from A to Z. The next step is we can we have to check our plain text. So this is M Y. So where M will come? M is here and Y is here. So what you have to do is you have to take this rectangle. So M, Y will be replaced with M you just check. So the 
rules are that it should not come in same row then same column so here you can see that m and y both are not in same row and same column so you can group them by using a rectangle over here and m will be replaced that is your cipher text for m will be the element next to that so it will move to the this right end so n and if you take y this is your rectangle so there is no element after y in this grouping rectangle so next to that is p so it can be like moving one element to the left next is n a so where it will come so you have to check in this here this is your n and a comes over here so which is not in same row and same column so you can take this rectangle you can make this group and check for that so n will be replaced by the element next to that which is o and a will be replaced by you don't have any element next to that because your rectangle ends over here so the element left to that is y so n a will be replaced by o y next is m e so you have to check m is here and e is here so which comes in the same column so what you have to do is this column you have to take your m will be so you have to go down and if the end of that reaches means you have to wrap around so m will be replaced by the next element below which is b and when you take e e will be replaced by the next element which is t so m e will be replaced by b and t next is s so i s i you can see here s you can see here which is in the same column so you have to take this one so s will be so it is i and s so i will be replaced by the next element which is b so as it is in the column means you have to move down so i will be replaced by d and s will be replaced by i next is christ so ch so c you have to check it is here and h is here so again this you have to take it as a rectangle which was because it's not in same row and same column so c will be replaced by the next element in that rectangle end which is u and h will be replaced by g the next is r i so i is here r is here so which is not in same row and same column so you can take this rectangle where as this rectangle is like this the next element of r will be replaced by it will go to wrap around which is the end s and i will be replaced by the end element in the rectangle which is next is s and t so s is over here and t is over here so which is in not in same row and same column so you can take this where your s will be replaced by the next element which is e and t will be replaced by the element left to that which is i so here we can see that our plain text is my name is christ and the cipher text we have got is n t o y d t d i u g s b e i so this is the cipher text so by using this playfair cipher we have converted or 
encrypted our message. The plain text was my name is Christ. The keyword given was security and we encrypted and we have got the zipper text which is this. Hope this is clear for everyone. If you find this useful, please share it with others. And if you are watching it for the first time, please subscribe. Thank you.